So today in Ask Allison, we have the following question. I want to get on insurance panels, but I'm really overwhelmed with the process of ongoing billing. I plan to pay for someone to get me credentialed, but I don't want to pay for billing. I'm so intimidated. I'm considering not getting on panels at all. I'm not techie. Should I just skip it? So first, I'd like to thank Therapy Nets for sponsoring us, um, who we're actually going to talk about in a minute. Um, I am not pro or anti-insurance. I want to be really, really clear about that. I'm pro you creating the practice that you want to create. Um, and if that includes taking insurance for the purpose of helping those who can't pay out-of-pocket cash pay, um, or because you know it's going to make the building part of your practice go a bit faster, like, I'm all for it. The only time I'm anti somebody else taking insurance is if they're making that decision based on scarcity, if they're afraid that they're not gonna be able to get full if they don't, because all of that, if you wanna be cash pay, all of that is learnable. We teach that in the Abundance Party and the Inner Circle. Um, but, uh, or if there's an insurance company, and these are specific insurance companies in specific places who don't pay and make you wait on hold for 45 minutes a day and stuff like that. So, in terms of ongoing billing, I think that you would be shocked at how easy it is when you have an electronic health record or practice management system, something like therapy notes, it's literally like a few clicks. Um, it's, it's hard to mess up as long as you're entering in the right things, like the right diagnosis code, for instance, which you're totally capable of, um, as long as things are hooked up. And if you have questions about how to hook it up after trying to do it yourself, therapy notes will actually get on the phone with you and walk you through it. So, um, I would also encourage you to ask a therapist friend to walk you through the process because I honestly think if you saw how you bill, um, you would be relieved at how easy it is. It's I billed insurance for years and I got to a point, and this was before um, the therapy notes, before anything like that, I could do it, um, like I had muscle memory for it. I could do it in less than 30 seconds per person. It's super easy. So I put that out there because I don't want this to be a reason that you don't build the practice that you want. You can totally learn this. It's easier than you think it's going to be as long as the insurance company isn't a bunch of jerks. Um, there are a handful of those. Um, so make sure that you talk to your colleagues in your zip code about the insurance they take and their experience with that insurance company so that you can get a realistic version of what it's going to be like to be on that panel. But if you want to take insurance, my friend, take insurance. The billing, if you can get through grad school, you can totally, totally bill. So that's what I've got for you today. I'll talk to you all later.